When I was building the plane, many people used to laugh at me. Oh, you madman, you never saw what you're doing. He had a dream, a dream nobody understood except he and his parents. Today, everybody, including those who didn't believe in him, is marveled at his intelligence as he flies his prototype aircraft. I never believed it, and I saw it with my eyes. I was surprised. I was so surprised. I never knew that he could fly the plane like this. Vidyo Tang, a Form 4 student of Martin Luther King's bilingual comprehensive high school, Bafusam, studying motor mechanics, says this is just the starting point. I want to build a plane that can transport people from the countries to another country. I can do it, but there's no income to do that. That's well, my hand is shot. A vision one of his teachers, Prince Lee Neber, so believes he has got all what it takes to accomplish. Vidal is a promising child. He is brilliant, fast in understanding. He is the initiator of that project. We only came in like his teachers to encourage him. The native of Mbuda, who is from a family of five, says life hasn't been a bed of roses given that his father is visually impaired. He is calling on the government and people of goodwill to help him realize his dream of becoming an aeronautical engineer. The only thing I need now is a very nice school for me to study aeronautics. Video Tang says he has been working on this project since the age of 10 and he only succeeded to fly his aircraft at the age of 17. That is seven years after, as if to say success is not an overnight type of deal. Kelvin Nembo reporting for CRTV News, Bafusam.